God bless you. Hello, Bishop Wooden here. I'm excited about the night. Now, I know I tell you all the time I'm excited, but you know, my friends, to be honest with you, these are some, <laughs> to say the least, weird times in which we live and things are happening every day. I tell you, the, tr the, the, the truth is that truth now, reality, is, is stranger than fiction. Sometimes the news is more of, a, of an attention getter and holder than a good movie because you see things played out that are actually taking place every day and you wonder to yourself, Lord, what is this world coming to? Well, I'll tell you what you're witnessing. You're witnessing the fulfillment of the Bible. You're witnessing the fulfillment of Scripture and the God of the Bible, my friends. Now, listen to me. Listen to me. He's in charge. He's in control and nothing is beyond his purview. Now, tonight, I have a word from the Lord that's going to bless you real good when it comes to dealing with the things that Satan have thrown in your way to try and frustrate you and to try to discourage you and make you quit and make you give in and make you throw up your hands and go, well, what's the use? Well, what's the use? The use is that the Lord is in control. You have a future. Good things lie ahead. There are marvelous things that the Lord wants to work in your life. And you can't give up. You can't quit. You can't stop. You can't let the devil attack you in the areas of business, relationships, education, health, home. You know, you name it. Listen, the God of the Bible has a remedy. And the remedy is the word of God, not magic, not some formula, not witchcraft, not some. Listen, I don't have any water to sell you uh, that came from the River Jordan. Nope, none of that stuff. Just the word of God. So we'll see you tonight here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. And we're going to jump in the word of God and see what the God of the Bible has to say to us. I'll see you tonight.